Hello friends, this video on communication systems part 1 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Topics to be covered in this lesson are Introduction What are communication systems? Elements of a communication systems Terminologies Bandwidth of a signal Bandwidth of transmission medium Modulation and its necessity Types of modulation wherein we'll talk about amplitude modulation, frequency modulation and phase modulation and then we'll discuss in detail about amplitude modulation. Okay, so let us have an introduction to this lesson on communication systems. So what do you think are we going to talk about here? When I say communication, first think about it. What all comes to your mind when I say communication? What do you mean by communication? Maybe the first thing that strikes your mind is speaking. We speak with each other. Why do we speak with each other? Because we want to communicate the information which we have to some other person. Right? Now, how do we communicate? How do we share information amongst each other? Now, with the advance in technology, with the passage of time, several new systems have come up which actually help in communication or which actually help us in communicating with each other. Not only when that person is near to us, but also when the person is far away from us. So when I think of these kind of systems which actually help us in sharing or in sending our information to some other person, there are certain things which comes to our mind. For example, the television. Now, when we watch something on a television, for example, the news which we watch on the television, do you think that the news reader comes only for us and he reads the news only for us? It's not like that. There are thousands and thousands of people in sitting at different places, different cities, different countries who are able to watch the same telecast. That, so that is what? That is nothing but sharing of information. So that news is getting communicated from one place to so many distant places. So we can say that television has become a communication system which actually helps in communicating information. Or a radio, the computers which we have. For example, I, I, do, I want to learn cooking. I want to know the recipe of a particular dish. What do I do? Either I call up my mom and ask her the recipe or I go to the internet. I Google it. Right? So, so what is that? That is again communication, right? Computer is actually enabling me to get information. So that is also an example of communication systems or the satellites, the um, antennas which we have, the telephone, the best example. Any time you want to talk to anybody, doesn't matter where that person is. Maybe you are in India, the other person is in America. You can talk to that person whenever you want. Right? So telephone or mobile phones they have become a necessity of our lives these days so these are some of the devices which actually help in communication right so in this lesson our focus is to understand the physics behind the communication systems what actually happens or what is the basic structure of a communication system so that is what is our agenda for this lesson right Okay, so with this, let us try to understand what are communication systems. How do we define, how do we exactly say that, okay, communication system will be a system which will have this, 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 this and this. So let us try to understand what is communication system. So what do you see on this screen? On this screen, we, we see two people talking to each other, right? So how do you think are they communicating with each other? I mean, let us suppose the person is speaking something. 
the other person is able to understand what he is speaking why is it so because they are using a common language to transfer the information now let us suppose if the first person is speaking in french the other person knows only english so he doesn't understand french so do you think that there will be an effective communication between these two people no right because whatever the first person is speaking the other person is not able to understand so there is no effective communication between the two person so the communication between two person will be effective only when they use a common language there has to be a common language which the one who is speaking is capable of speaking and the other one who is listening is capable of understanding right so whenever i say communication or whenever i say communication system it is nothing but a system which enables the transfer of information so what is communication system it is a system that enables the act of information transmission and now you must be seeing that i am using this term information quite often so looks like that information is the key point in communication system so communication system exists because information exists so what exactly is information what, i mean what is that which we define as information well information is nothing but any meaningful fact we can say any fact which is known to us and which is meaningful is an information it can be anything it can absolutely be anything for example we are talking to anybody we we share our personal details we share our name what do we do where do we work what do i like what are my hobbies so when you are talking to a stranger and you are sharing these information what are they they are some meaningful facts right so that is nothing but information similarly when we sit in front of the computer and we google for something we want to know the address of a particular mall or we want to uh, locate a particular school so we google it so what is that that address is nothing but an information it is a meaningful fact which is going to help you so that is again an information right now this information can be of many types it is not always necessary that an information has to be data data means like name phone number address whatever information you have in the form of data so it is not always necessary that information will always be in the form of data it can be in the form of a video it can be in the form of audio so when i say video the best example would be your television so we see so many things which actually is in the form of a video for example we watch movies we watch serials right and all those things are again information they are trying to give certain information to us but that is in the form of video similarly audio when we listen to music or we listen to the radio even in television it is not only video but video combined with audio so now information can be in any of these forms it can be in the form of audio or video or data so we can say that this information can be in the form of audio or video or data right so now the question is how do these transfer take place that means how the transfer of data or transfer of audio or video take place from one place to another because here you can see that these two people are sitting just next to each other and they are talking so that is why they are able the other person is able to hear what the first person is speaking but now let us suppose if the second person goes far away the first person is sitting at delhi and the second person goes to bangalore so do you think whatever the first person will speak the second person will be able to hear no right because the distance is huge but still communication is possible with the help of telephones right we have these mobile phones we also have the facility to chat in your computers over the internet right so communication is still possible even over very large distances so in this lesson we are going to see how the transfer of information takes place over larger distances right that is going to be our objective
here in this lesson and I am sure that by the time we reach towards the end of the lesson we will we will be able to achieve or we will be able to reach our objective. Thank you. Please visit www.examfear.com to watch more videos, attempt free online test, get free study material, find tutors and mentors. Thank you once again.